Okay, just a real short video on how to um, how to have a better mount for the Helix uh, 7s series um, with the Hobie Guardian uh, transducer mount. So there's plenty of videos on how to mount uh, the Fish Finder transducers with the Guardian series, but I've seen a lot of them where there's one where they cut it out and put it back in here and it kind of sits down in there. Uh, I found on my buddy's kayak that he doesn't very get a very good um, reading with the side scan on it. Uh, he gets a lot of turbulence um, because this is sitting down in there a little further, uh, right there. So when your waves and stuff like that are going through there, it just does, it doesn't give him a uh, very good reading. So I wanted my transducer to actually be sitting down on the bottom of the hull more. You can see the the side scan right here is completely clear, and then I use this little. Um, zip tie and basically with the helix 7 series you'll see what i did there is you just drill a hole right here um in the guardian mount for your uh transducer cord to fit through and then you're going to need a dremel and it's super easy you just take the dremel and clear off a little bit of this right here you can see where i cleared it off right here um just enough for the front of this to fit in there so it's completely guarded and then the only other thing is just like in the other video where the guy uses the um uses the hummingbird mounting um, brackets you're going to need those but you don't have to cut a hole with it all you have to do is you're going to need a little dremel and you're going to have to take off the edge of the um of the um hummingbird uh things you'll see like right here you'll just have to take off the edge of it just a little edge on it and if there needs to be a video for that i can do that but that's all you got to do so you just flip them around so they face the other way clear this um, with a Dremel, just clean it off right here, and then drill a hole for your transducer. And then you can see these already have these pre-cut holes right here for like uh, water um, to flow out. You just take a zip tie and it fits, lines up perfectly, put one zip tie right there straight across the back and zip tie it in there. And that's all you have to do. Uh, so you just need the only uh, parts you need are a half inch drill bit and um, our tools, I mean, is a half inch drill bit and then you need a Dremel and you can make this work and it looks a lot cleaner than the other way and you also get a better reading out of your um, side scan with it. Uh, if you have any questions, just go ahead and ask. Thanks for watching. Bye.